It's a tale as old as Aesop, dreams of instant riches coming true in a flash. The new million dollar winners in Missouri, the Hill family, come on up. And today, a mechanic from Dearborn, Missouri, a newly minted Midas, went public. There was a second winner of the $588 million mega jackpot. Who else had the magic Powerball touch? Could it be this ecstatic guy spotted at a Maryland gas station? The mystery winner has yet to come forward. So what if you strike lottery gold? Pay heed to these tales of riches and ruin. First, the tale of a regular Joe, unemployed construction worker, Joe Dinette. He confesses he went on an obscene Woo! spending spree after winning more than $75 million. If I can win, anybody can win. It does have the ball foul. He quickly blew through 20 million bucks. Joe confesses he splurged on grown-up toys most guys only dream of. This is my toy. A fleet of ATVs, a boat, six houses. We call that end of the house the East Wing. Lots of fancy cars, yeah. and for wife <laughs> Megan, a four-carat diamond. But his biggest purchase? I would say my NASCAR team. Joe admits he's nearly blown through half his riches in about three years. But he's not troubled. Don't we don't have checking. to worry about money. We don't. Joe admits he's yet to see the downside. It's nice to be able to get up in the morning and say, I don't have to go to work. Maybe Joe should heed the cautionary tale of Jack Whitaker. After getting an unbelievable gift on Christmas Day 2002, $314 million. Jack confesses that the wheel of fortune turned against him hard. My wife had said she wished that she had torn the ticket up. Well, I wish that we had torn the ticket up too. His marriage crumbled. He started hanging out at strip clubs. And just like King Midas, his fortune cost him a loved one. Jack's beloved 17-year-old granddaughter, Brandy, whom he showered with cash, was found dead after descending into heavy drug use with her boyfriend. I pretty much lost everything I held dear in my life. The fabled lottery win has been kinder to Alexandra Char, a waitress still working after striking it rich. She remembers telling her boyfriend. And I went inside and I asked him, if he had any doubts about me. And he said, I'm gonna marry you one day. Everything's gonna be okay. And then I said, yay, because I won a million dollars. <laughs> Good answer. Today, Alexandra confesses she's learned the moral of the story. If you rely on money for happiness, yeah, chances yeah. are you'll never find it. I asked myself, why is it me that won the lottery? I believe it was given to me because I'm gonna do something great with it. 